I still can't get these fucking graphics to work! The mighty foot of justice. Fuck that. It's the chin of justice, damn it. Yeah, you're right about that. Here comes the crimson chin. To them I say nay. I love it blowing shit up. That's the only good part. Is this whole section right here just you and the ship? This whole section a little bit, and then you get to go into a car. I know, I know we get into the truck. I remember, I remember in the demo that, um, you play the very first level of the game, and, you, and then it switches you all the way to the truck level. Yep, very odd pacing, but, and it does that. Oh, yeah. first. Oh, for a second I thought I was playing that one song that goes dun 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 Oh, it did. It was. It was? Yeah. Oh. I love that song. Oh, yeah, it is. Holy shit. Told ya. There's a name. There's a name to that song. I just can't think of it. If Chris was here, he would know. Hey, look, John's here. I'm gonna kill him. Duke, this is General Golden. I suck the dick. Yeah, I know. I knew that he was. I know he told me that he wanted to strictly go to East Gaming. Yeah, which means we're never gonna be able to play with him again. I don't know whether that's bad, bad or good. I haven't played Beyond and Xbox 360 in a very, very long time. I think the last time I ever done anything with him is when I hung out with him one time. But I think Alan was with us too. I'm not too sure. I that, that was like all the way in October though. Blow shit up. This is really what this entire part probably would be about. Me just blowing shit up this fucking ship. Well, we can't get any closer, otherwise, we're gonna get blown out of the sky. Really? I'm gonna live. I'm the hero of the story. I know I'm gonna live. So, fuck those. Well, I don't wanna fuck with you. Why close? All that's going through my mind right now telling them to go fuck themselves. Hard to live blow shit up. Blow shit up. I am blowing shit up. Jingle. Sorry, the autopilot's stuck right now. It keeps going in circles for some reason. Why do we even have a fucking autopilot? I'm Good pretty sure I've missed killing someone. Good question. I'll get you back I'll get back on to you. There they are. There's the assholes. Ah, their ship went to in and out before they came. You know, I could have probably jumped out of there because I'm so fucking built in muscle mass. I'm pretty sure I would, this fall would not kill me or even break my bones. Honestly, I was just expecting Duke just to drop down and just go guns blazing instead of having to rely on that grenade launcher. Oh yeah, there's another achievement I forgot. You have to find a bunch of nudie calendars. Fuck you, President. <sighs> Along with uh, ans uh, picking up every phone in the game that you find. Mm. Okay, so there are a bit of those collectible achievements. Not really collectible because you don't really get shit out of it other than the achievement, so yeah. Well, collectible can mean still collecting something to a Hello, lady. It's too dark, I can barely see it. Then your screen settings are not good enough. Oh, I'm at 360. So am I. <laughs> For some reason, my connection gives me. 144p, which is why every time I'm watching the connection, like the screen fucking sucks. I fuck up here so many damn times. It's so hard to control this goddamn truck. 
It is. Like I said, I've played I've played old arcade ga racing games, ones that sh should have really terrible controls, and I played them better than I play this. This is like a tried to be like an in between of archaic and simulation. It just it, it's a horrible hybrid that just doesn't work out well. Hey, it's loading screen. Woo! And loading it was like what? Probably ten minutes of actual gameplay. Yeah. Less? Yeah, most likely less. First part, all we did was just blow shit up until we got the truck. So we're just doing what we do best, and then finally we got our <laughs> truck. I'm pretty sure part two is going to be a majority of driving, getting out, and shooting, and then driving until you get to that one part where we have to go into the mine. Because if there's one part I will remember, it's the whole truck section. It's hard to forget it. No matter how much you want to push it out of your subconscious, it's always there. No, it's not. Yeah, you're right. What are we doing again? I will hide or press it far in the down so that no one will ever know. Also, you know, there's they hit. When it comes to stuff like this, they always have like a certain track for you to, you know, follow just in case. Now it's designed. There's so many multiple pathways and everything like that. I do enjoy that part. You actually have to fucking figure it out. And I'll say this right now. I got lost. Yeah. I fucking got lost. I didn't know what the hell where I was going. I didn't even know if there was an up or down anymore. That's how lost I got. Yeah, it would be nice if there was like at least something to help to help guide you i mean it would there be are. they're called arrows is there billboards with arrows yeah you see we drive by them they're fucking arrows pointing where we're supposed to be going do, 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 do. yeah you know it would have been would have been more awesome if they designed this a bit better where it's not linear. It was non linear and you'll be able to take multiple pathways. Most games it's always linear. The only well, time it's not linear is when it's an actual RPG. And even then, a lot of times it's still fucking linear. Yeah, RPGs can still be can still be linear. There's always a point A to point B. It's how you how you make the journey is up to you. Ow. Do 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 do. Driving around in the truck. Driving around in the truck. Driving, 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 driving around in the truck. Just driving around the truck. I am pulled out of my fucking mind. Haha. <laughs> Grab your ass over and made a jump. I'm surprised your ego doesn't go up just by getting in the car itself. No, no. Every time the you want to know why the ego doesn't go up? Because you have to constantly refill this fucking thing. <laughs> no, my friend. This, car, this thing gets... You can't You can't have a big eagle when you're in a fucking car like this. When you try to just rev the damn engine... $500, right there. Well, I was going to say that his truck is fueled by his ego. No. No. It's not. If it was, then he would have unlimited gas. Yeah, it's fucking... Gas, <laughs> gas tanks never be refilled again. Did you just see that? I just tapped him and he died. Yeah, like, all right. Eh, eh. Eh. <laughs> Jerk tap. Damn, he's D class soldier material. Hell, he maybe even F class. <laughs> Is there anything other than uh, lower than D? Well, we can't say G because there actually are some RPGs that G rank is a really good rank. So, uh. I'm guessing Catholic must be great. Huh? Huh? I don't and know. And supposed to be four losers or fuck it. We just put them in there for no reason. <laughs> they don't even get a rank. <laughs> oh shit! Fuck, uh, uh. swerve, 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 swerve. Jump! And now we're gonna be. Ah! Ah! 
I see this shit? <laughs> Out of gas. So many cars. <laughs> you know, I'm just gonna say this right now. We have a big ass bed that we can just probably put a bunch of fucking gas tanks into. Why the hell hasn't he figured this out yet? Yeah, I know. That giant, uh, a giant Does space in the no, back no of his truck there no just screams, fill me up, please. Yeah, you can, you can literally put a fucking bed in there to keep carry all the fucking gasoline he needs and have it feed into the goddamn engine. He could, but he decides to create his ego miles, for brains. This car gets 0.5 miles to the gallon, and it takes 100 gallons. Shit. Yeah, it's a terrible car. It gets five like miles to the ego. Gets five gets five gallons to the ego. What the gallon? Oh, fuck! Surprised I didn't get killed by that. Yes indeedy. Killing shit, I'm a killing shit. I'm a killing, 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 killing. No real point. In fact, I'm getting bored just watching this. It's the same stuff over and over again. You run around, you shoot things. Then you stop to do an objective. You run around and shoot things. Duke Nukem at its finest, ladies and gentlemen. Does the real gun, if you shoot them in the head, does their head, like, stop for a second and then explode, or...? Oh, the gun that I was using? Yeah. yeah. Okay. It expands. Yeah, because I was recalling one game that had a sniper, and every time you shoot somebody in the head, their... Yeah, their head would expand and then just explode. Oh, I was wondering if it was this game. Or who knows, maybe I'm thinking of destroy all humans with the anal probe. <laughs> uh, so. that's, I guess that's one game I do miss on the PlayStation. There we go! <laughs> You're admiring everything in the office. I am. And it's called boobies, pornos, and everything else. These pictures you'll counter later when you're back at the Hoover Dam. <laughs> the only reason why I know that is because when it came to my turn to record the rest of the Hoover Dam, I was fucking around with everything because I had no idea where the hell I needed to go. You know what? I'm just going to say this right now. This all looks like downtown Detroit now. This entire game is us going through downtown Detroit. And it's just as clean as it. Hey ho! See, look. We have all this space that we could easily just put. It's just. It's a bit. It's just. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just expecting a whole arm. A whole walk of the dead zombie whore just starting to walk by the highway. <laughs> Brian. <laughs> Brian? Yeah, Brian's brains. Hey, loading screen! Okay, time to go fucking do something worthwhile for my life for the next two hours that this little screen's on. Speaking of, low, speaking of Walking Dead, I, I do need to finish the third season. That's where I kind of stopped. <laughs> I think it's only on the third season. No, it's on the fourth season. It's I've I think it I think it's like halfway through fourth season right now. But just I decided to get into it like the end of October, and I watched like the all of season one and season two. Then I just got bored when I reached half of season three, and like uh, you know I'm kind of Walking Dead pooped out. Uh, it's a good it's a oh, good show. Oh, just so you guys know the. The Walking Dead does actually have a comic book series, except in the comic books, the story is completely different. They all, some of the characters are, in fact, in it, 
But a lot of them, like the favorite ones, such as uh, God, what's his name again? What's the the, the redneck guy that everyone loves? Daryl. Daryl. Yeah, he does actually does not exist in the comic book series, which is the original form of Walking Dead. Yeah, I know that Walking Dead was a comic book before the TV yeah, show well, came out. Yeah, well, a lot out. of people actually do. And uh, also, you know the governor and how insane he was. Yeah. In the comic books, he's a lot darker. He actually I... had sex with the zombie daughter. Yeah, I I do recall that because I remember somewhere on MSN or something like that. Sometimes a lot of websites do a lot of uh, media news, and they, that was one of them for some reason. They say it was like one of the most disturbing things that was put in comics so far. Extremely disturbing. The fact that a guy, a, a man, actually rapes his daughter, who's a zombie. I'm gonna need a yeah, he's a complete nutball. I'm actually surprised. No, you, probably, you haven't seen the season yet, so I don't want to spoil it. So you might want to mute me for a second as I tell the fans who probably already don't want, also want me to spoil it. But guess what? I'm just gonna spoil it anyway. So fuck you well, guys. Well, if you're gonna spoil it, then I might as well listen to it. So go ahead. All right. Well, Governor actually does finally die, and he dies by the hand of the person he kind of like falls in love with again. He meets a new group of people after a few months on the run. After trying to destroy the the uh, prison and failing to do so, hmm. yeah, and uh, he kills Herschel. Yeah, yeah, he actually kills Herschel. Yeah, in the final, in the past season, season four, mid season finale, he kills Herschel, chops his head off with the samurai sword. Oh, jeez, because he captured. The what's her name? The black chick or whatever, samurai chick. Yeah, the one that had the uh, two zombies already tied in chains everywhere she burned them with her. Yeah, I she's can't with, recall her she's name. She's with the sheriff's the sheriff's group now. Yeah, along with uh. Hey, look, we got a rat. I boy, and I am too. fucking drunk. This is why I do this because I am drunk. Begin uh, my being rat. <laughs> God, this isn't a big yet. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, a lot of the people, characters that were on the governor's side die. A lot of people who were on the main people's side die. So yeah, it was just really... The mid-season finale was really just to get rid of all those background characters along with new characters who were in there just to get rid of them. Because they feel like they don't play a role or something in the story. I feel bad for all of the other people that the governor, you know had not really in prison but had them in their own little I utopia like as he called oh, it no, like they, that, they were yeah, just the, victims of circumstance and i fell to my death oh the don't don't worry those people were saved they joined the sheriff's group in the prison they actually started building a farm and all that for a few months they were successful then a virus a flu came around started killing people and then they started turning to zombies so wait, there's actually now a flu? Or something yeah, they, like that? they actually put in there that, yeah, by the way, if you get sick and you die, you're going to become a zombie. Well, I know that the, like, the whole thing they is They put terrible. a virus in there, an actual flu virus or something that went around and started infecting people and was people were dying in the prison. Okay, because, like I said, I already knew that, you know, it's all airborne and everything like that, so it doesn't matter if you get bit by the zombies or not, just if you die, you become one of them. Yep, but yeah, but they, the difficulty was added on to where even if they died, they were like, oh, well, okay, so if I don't get eaten by them, I'm not going to die or anything. If I don't get hurt, I'm not going to die. Well, guess what? You forgot. There's illnesses in the world that can kill you. Well, fuck. So, wait, it, is that what you're just pretty much saying? Just regular illnesses will do that? A lot of them that are very dangerous, yes. Okay, I thought you, I thought you were going through like a whole... Thing that there's actually a virus. That oh, there's an actual virus, virus, an actual outbreak, a small outbreak in the prison. Hmm. We'll continue this in the next video. Yeah, well, I'll definitely have to catch up on my watching then.